Hey guys, it's Crafty Fox, and in this video, you'll learn how to use World Edit. So I'm gonna teach you all you need to know for the basics of World Edit. Since some people they come on my server and they don't have a clue on how to use it, but once you learn it, you'll be really grateful on it, and you'll be like, "Why didn't I use this before?" So first off, you need a wooden axe, and for most servers, they use wooden axe, of course. So just in case it's not a wooden axe, you just write. Slash last wand and it should appear so I just made a bunch of wooden axes now And uh, these are just some of the commands that you can use and I'm just going to teach you the basics so Let's see. Let's say you want to make uh, This duplicated over there, so uh, You would get this axe and then you would left click uh, position the first one and then you would right click the other corner and then that would select this whole area so imagine it's like 3D and then you would go to where you want to copy it so let's say you want to remember this position copy it can move like 10 blocks or whatever length you need it and you could just paste it and it'll paste it in the same exact position so if you come up over here and write slash last copy it's gonna copy this position so when you move it it should paste it like that so what if you wanted to copy it uh, without without the original one you like you want to kind of <laughs> get rid of it so you'd write cut instead and that would get rid of it and it's basically it's the same exact thing alright so another command you can use is move which is pretty self-explanatory but let's say you want to move this 10 blocks that way so you just select the region slash slash move whatever blocks you need to do and let's say like you want to undo that you like you made a mistake so you could just write undo and then move 20 blocks like whatever and then you could just experiment with that and also you can uh, do redo that's another command you can use so let me just undo that again and uh, this is uh, another helpful command is stack so before I learned stack I probably wasted countless hours but basically you can select this region here and let's say you want to copy this all the way over there like you want to have the same exact thing so you just write stack face the direction you want to stack it in and type in the number of blocks and you can see it just copies and pastes it all around all along in a line so that's really helpful to use like if you're making walls and speaking of walls you can actually uh, make walls using a command so like what if you want to have a fenced off area like here but you don't want to have stuff in the middle uh, basically what you would do is write slash slash walls and type in the ID of what you want so you could be like one is stone so then you'll have a stone wall and let's say you actually want to fill in the area you would just write slash slash set and then type in whatever you want uh, you can do like any type of any type of block, let's say iron, for example. And then, if you want to delete blocks, it's simple. You just select the region you want and type in slash slash set zero, and it'll turn it into air. All right, so here's another scenario you may come across. So let's say you're like, I want to copy and paste this and put that right above where that uh, red square is. So you just uh, you do your usual stuff, you copy it. Maybe you actually cut it because I don't want this anymore. And then you want to place it right here. And you'll be like, oh my god, the original one disappeared. Because it copies the air and like, you don't want to do that. So this is a command that I learned how to do. You just write slash slash paste space uh, minus a and then it wouldn't copy the air so this is a really useful command uh, for a world edit let's say uh, you have a red line all right and then you want to make it diagonal so basically what you would do select the line copy it or cut it whatever you want rotate and you could put in the angle so let's say I want to rotate it 90 degrees and then it would paste it like that it's in a straight line alright so what if you wanted to paste it with an angle that's not a multiple of 90 let's say 20 for example 
and then that's how you do it basically <laughs> although it might not be perfect so you can actually do this uh, with like roads and stuff but it's not gonna be perfect alright so sometimes it's not gonna paste all that perfectly so you could be left with little holes but that's uh, what you get when you do this and honestly it's not that bad you can just fill in the holes and it'll save you a lot of time if you do need it another one you can use is um, if you've been wondering how they do it on these servers I remember when I had no clue how to do it let's say uh, you saw a mixture of a road for example like dirt stone cobblestone you're like how they do that do they do it by hand of course not what they do is write uh, set and they type in whatever ID they want so one is stone then you put comma uh, cobblestone uh, I spelled that wrong cobblestone and maybe some grass which is two and that's how you get those mixtures <laughs> yeah that's like one of the basics uh, if you already know how to use world it that won't surprise you but yeah so another one is flip so let's say you're making an airplane right and you already got like one of the wings down and then you want to copy and paste that like over there but if you do that it's gonna paste like exactly like that so you're gonna end up with two uh, left wings so let's say let's actually fix that so you would basically copy and you would type in flip and that's gonna make it go the other side and you also have to rotate it if you don't it will just end up like that so make sure uh, you rotate it so rotate 180 degrees and let's move on this side and yeah, paste so then you can finish your aircraft like that so those are the basics of how to use world edit I hope you guys enjoy this video and learn how to do stuff and I hope you guys actually use world edit in the future because uh, I've been I remember working without it and it just wasted a lot of time I remember I used MC edit but the good thing about world edit is that you can build it in game and it's a heck of a lot faster so anyways guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time bye